Welcome back to Underwater Math. Let's describe some multiplication and division patterns. The table shows the number of students and chaperones on school field trips. What can we tell from the information in the table? On the field trip with 25 students, there were 5 chaperones. That means there were 25 divided by 5 equals 5 students for every one chaperone. Good! Now let's check the other rows in the table to make sure the rule is true for all of them. 40 divided by 8 is 5. So on this field trip there were also 5 students for every one chaperone. On the next row, 50 divided by 10 is also 5. The rule is true here too. And on the last row, 100 divided by 20 equals 5. So again, we have 5 students for every one chaperone. Great work! So, would you say that the rule would be to divide the number of students by 5, to find the number of chaperones needed? That sounds right. Can we go to the aquarium for our next field trip? I'm sure that could be arranged, but only if you can help me calculate how many chaperones we'll need.